All right, I'm going to show you the end of the video before I show you the beginning of the video. Um, you're not going to believe where I where I got this this video and what I had to go through to get it. I mean, we're talking zoom in, take a you know a screen recording, uh, upload that file, zoom in a little bit more, you know, and basically repeat the process until you get this close. Now. Uh, this was probably, I don't know, a good hundred yards up in the night sky, a family film. This, you see me right there playing around on my editing app, you know, trying to zoom in earlier today to get you this video incredibly difficult, but you know, the more I do this, the better I, I'm learning the little tricks of the trade. I'm learning how to zoom in on these objects and to make it even more interesting, there's these weird lights around this craft. It reminds me of a classic flying saucer, like a disc-shaped craft. By the way, thank you to the original uploader for allowing me to use your video and giving me your permission. Thank you. It's much appreciated. So, uh, and we'll get to it around the two minute mark. I'm going to show you where this came from but you look you can see it rotating it looks like some type of propulsion coming out of the bottom um you know maybe i uh, just said some type of energy i'm not quite sure what we're looking at here and again it was incredibly difficult to get the shot here um it took me about seven hours in total my que loucura, mano. Já tem mais alguém vendo? Eu tô gravando. Eu sei que não é um disco voador, porque não existe, mas parece corre, muito. Corre, corre. Cá, que viado. Okay, it is difficult to believe, but the disc-shaped craft came from the middle of those lights right there. Now, I first saw the video, and I have to admit, I'm gonna, I'm gonna play the video in its entirety here in a minute. Uh, but I, I first saw the craft, I was like, or the lights rather, and I was like, okay, whatever, flares, uh, drone, CGI, who knows, right? But when I zoomed in, I was like, oh my God, there's actually something there, okay? Uh, that shouldn't be there. You know, it reminds me of that video I made, uh, the, uh, the Canada video. You guys go check that out because I think it might be the same craft or technology. Okay, another look at it here. Uh, you see these lights? And it, it kind of had this weird triangular shape and then a disc round shape. And then in the middle of all of it is this weird mushroom, I don't know, disc. I mean, what do we call it, guys? I don't know. Amazing, right? This is incredible. This is why you come to my channel right here. So you can hear my cat meowing in the background as I'm making a UFO video. How freaking cool is that? So guys, again, this is not CGI. I didn't create this. Uh, the original uploader <laughs> has a UFO or not a, or a channel that is not a UFO cha based channel. Kitty, kitty. Anyway, guys, I'm out. Sorry, guys. I had a cat and a bird talking to me. Shout out Mr. OJ and Gypsy, but let's get back to it. Here's the original sighting right here untouched unfiltered okay uh in its original format and you see these lights up there i'm like okay whatever you know probably a drone probably flares but 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 i zoomed in and i saw that weird mushroom metallic disc i don't know what to call it a flipping flying saucer right what's going on here this is crazy. You see it up there. Now, you see that, that that shot right there. At the beginning of the video is what I was able to do after, you know, I ran it through my software, zoomed in, and, and did all the, you know, the video magic that I'm able to do. So, all right, guys, leave a comment below.